Mike Foster here. Today I'm going to show you how to eat, what are these guys? These are eggplants. Take a shot down here. These are different eggplants. This is your basic purple globe eggplant. They grow this big. So this is one everyone's seen. This is, guess what that's called? A white eggplant. That one's easy. This one looks exactly like, almost like an Italian eggplant, but this was actually an, a Japanese eggplant. They grow a little smaller, a little thinner, and they have a, a nice taste. And this one is prevalent here in California, but also in India where the eggplant actually, I think, began. It's called an Indian eggplant. Check them all out. How to eat eggplant? You pull this tip off like this. Pull these off. You peel it off. Okay. That guy's off. And then, let's say you wanted to cook these and put them in put them on the grill. You would just cut it like this. You poke it a few times with a knife. Salt and pepper it. And you grill that thing on the grill. That's one way to eat eggplant. Another way, and I have a video about it, is baba ganoush. What is baba ganoush? Baba ganoush is a Middle Eastern staple made with garbanzo beans. It's similar to hummus, but the base is eggplant. And I'll show you a quick little clip about that of the, how I made baba ganoush. But my favorite way of making eggplant is all this stuff. Check it out. Eggplant parmesan, okay? I'm gonna show you how to make eggplant parmesan. And there's many ways to eat eggplant as I talked about. Eggplant, by the way, is loaded with fiber. It's one of the best antioxidant foods you can have. Um, and it's actually considered a brain food because of something called nasunin. Nasunin. I might not be pronouncing that right, but it's a brain food. So antioxidants are good for you. Fiber's good for you. Eggplant's good for you. I'm gonna show you how to make an eggplant parm. The first thing you do is you slice the eggplants like this. You can keep the skin on them. I sliced all this beautiful eggplant. There's the white variety, there's the Indian one. Here's the, the purple one. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna put this in the oven so we can take some of the bitterness out and we can soften it a little. And then I will layer this plate there and make eggplant parm. So let's pop this in the oven. And I'll see you in a few minutes. All right, these guys just came out of the oven. Oh yeah, look at them. Nice and soft. So here's the eggplant that just came out of the oven. It's nice and fork tender. Now we're gonna layer this beautiful eggplant parm. We're gonna cook it and I'm gonna show you the best way to eat eggplant. We're gonna throw in some olive oil on the bottom. That's always a good way to start. A little marinara. Okay, spread this around. And we'll start layering it. Layer these just like a lasagna. It's, you just layer it just like a lasagna. These are in perfect shape. I have to say I did a good job on these. Okay. Let's get these layered. All right. Now, layer it with some of these beautiful mozzarella cheese. A few mushrooms. A little more sauce. Put that baby on there. And then start the layering process again. Eggplant. All right, I'll see you when it's finished. All right, look at his baby. Now we're just gonna top it off with some shredded mozzarella. Oh, this thing looks grand. Marvelous. Okay, little shredded mozzarella. This is a layered eggplant parm. Okay, I'm gonna pop this in the oven. I'll see you in a few minutes. How to eat eggplant? There's a lot of ways. You can grill it. You can make baba ganoush. You can do it in many different ways. It's a very healthy and versatile veggie. I made this one in a, whoa, there's a lot of cheese on that. 
in the eggplant parmesan. Let's get close up, see how this tastes. That's absolutely amazing. Ooh, this is good. Until next time. Peace. First, start off with a medium to large size eggplant. And now you're gonna peel the skin off at intervals. I'm gonna chop these up. Next what we do is take a sheet pan Coat it with oil, and we put each of the medallions on top. Okay, we're going to put these in the oven right now. You can see these have been in for about 45 minutes. Look at they're nice and brown. Now you season these to taste, depending on how much garlic you like. Now to this, we're going to add we're going to add a a lemon. Squeeze this like this through your hand so you can catch any of the seeds and we're gonna put a couple of tablespoons in there this is the finished product and this is how you serve it just a little like that taking a nice big dip with this olive oil look at that consistency Isn't that beautiful you ready